Apes Legends is game director Dan Tudge. Dan, great to see you. How's yeah, everything? You, My fellow Canadian, come on down here and let's talk about Sword Course Legends. So uh, this is a game that will be at E3. Uh, you guys have been working really hard on it, I know. Tell us, uh, what can we expect from it? Well, today we're going to show you, uh, or we'll, we're going to show this week, we're going to show campaign creation, which is probably yeah. the most exciting feature of the whole thing. You know, with Sword Coast Legends, you get to play as a dungeon master with four other players, and I think creating those stories and those campaigns is really what, uh, what the heart of the whole thing is for us. Yeah. All right, so we've got some gameplay up here. Uh, tell us about uh, the team and what you guys have been building with this. Uh, you know, it's... Obviously, looks uh, looks great. It looks you know a lot of detail to the animation. Uh, but as you play through, uh, what, what's the experience going to be like? Well, this is very much built on the uh, you know the legacy of all the great uh, D and D RPG classics. So Baldur's yeah. Gate and uh, Neverwinter Nights, Nice Icewind Dale, and, and for many of us, we came from Bioware and yes. actually joined up with N Space. So um, so you're going to see a lot of uh, a lot of those games in there and games like Dragon Age Origins. Yeah. Yeah, I mean, the legacy of the team, as you said, is uh, very tried and true with this. Uh, you know, as you play through it, uh, the experience of it, I mean, tell us about sort of the, the as you play through it, some of the, some of the abilities you're going to have as you play through this game. So you've got, uh, you've got pause and play, so it's party-based tactical, and you've got okay. pause and play. Now, if you're playing with, the, with yourself, you've got companions that you've met along the way, and, and uh, you control those much as you would in Baldur's Gate or Neverwinter Nights. You pause the action and, and, and that. And if you're playing multiplayer, which is something we've added, um, you've brought in real people from outside the world, uh, you know, within the world, and uh, you're playing with them cooperatively. Well, all right, how many players will it support? Five. And Five the fifth players. being the Dungeon, Dungeon Master. DM. Yeah, cool. So that must be fun to be the DM, and uh, just like people like from, you know, Baldur's Gate and whatnot, this, uh, this game, where is it in development right now? We're, we're about three and a half months off from, from completion. We're getting okay. really close, yeah. So we'll yeah. see it uh, later this summer or fall? Yes, you'll see it September 8th on PC and later in the year on, uh, on consoles. Oh, great. So it's going to come to consoles as well? Yes. All right. Well, it looks very cool, Sword Coast Legends. It's nice to see D&D uh, coming back in a big way for fans, and uh, PC's the place to start. Cause That's right. a lot of fans very there. Much so. Dan, thank you very much for thank the uh, sneak peek at uh, Sword Coast Legends. We've got much more coming up, uh, but right now, 